What do you want? Do you want some apple? Now this is feeding time. Now this is what I call a lot of monkeys. Where are we, Kim? Kyoto. Kyoto train station. Kyoto Eki. And what are you eating? Um, um, rice ball. Yummy. So this is Kyoto station. Massive, massive building. So that's where the trains are over there, and that's the exit. No, that's Kim. It's the exit over there. Um, it's stay in um, Kyoto. <laughs> okay, uh, just 40 minutes outside of Kyoto, there is a little town called Arashiyama. Uh, Rashiyama is a place which is all about this big river that they've got here, which is really cute. Big birds can land here. But there's another really interesting thing about Rashiyama, which is it's it's got a little mountain to the side. And at the mountain, they've got monkeys. And there, there are lots of them uh, just running around. So from the river part, we're going to head along and go up the mountain up there to go see the monkeys. Another thing that often happens when you're in Japan is that Japanese kids want to give you an interview, uh, usually for school. They have to speak to a foreigner. Are they asking you questions, Claire? Yeah. <laughs> My name is Dominic. <laughs> Dominic. Dominic. of interest is a monkey smoking a cigar or maybe eating a drumstick <laughs> and then the other thing that's interesting is all the dead stuff that's right beside it look at them all hundreds of them very strange maybe big spiders in there Some great Japanese English here. The monkey park is not only a monkey, the bird and deer also look for. Brilliant. And up the hill, we keep going. There's meant to be over 200 monkeys up on this mountain. And uh, it's quite funny, they're, they're sometimes very quiet whenever you're walking up the hill you might not notice one that is suddenly right beside you. But at the same time, up at the top where they get their food, they can be really noisy. You can hear them jumping around through the trees just now. And then when you get up to the top, you'll see monkeys absolutely, well, kind of absolutely everywhere, all picking off fleas.
Oh, you gotta get the peanuts. So, tickling. <laughs> Look at these little buggers. Oh, I think the baby one. <laughs> no, I don't want the beach. I'm sorry, I just can't. Grumpy monkey. No, I don't want to. <laughs> And look at you, Mr. Grumpy Pants. cool thing about this place is that you can be either inside or you can be outside with the monkeys. Itchy bum. One of the things that all the monkeys do is once they've had their lunch time, they then stop fighting with each other. Uh, some of the baby monkeys start playing with each other, which looks like a fight, but then the adults usually start to groom each other. It's really quite, quite cute. Especially, it's also quite strange after they've just been really fighting with each other for their nuts and their apples. One thing you don't want to look at is a monkey's bum. It's, it's not that attractive. <laughs> 